Hey guys, it's Lee with the Turquoise Valentine and I got my son Colin here tonight. Um, we're just going to give it a few seconds for some people to hop on and we're going to do a little craft and Colin's going to look at comments and he's just going to entertain, I guess. Supervise. And supervise. <clears throat> oh, there's some people hopping on. Is Paige going to watch? Mm -hmm. Okay. Say hey once you hop on so we'll know you're here. <clears throat> I always seem to get choked when I go on live. <laughs> hey Kaylee. Hey Carol. There's some of my friends. Hey Kim. Hey Dee from Texas. Hey Elizabeth and Susan. <clears throat> Clint. Hey Kim. Clint and Donna. It must be Donna. I bet it's Donna. <laughs> I don't think Clint's probably watching. Sylvia and Mary and Kim and Jen. Thank you, Kaylee. <clears throat> There's Julie and hey, Donna. Julie. Hey, Michelle. Teresa. Colin, you're watching too. Yeah. <laughs> he's watching comments, so it tells us when he's on. Hey, Charisse. Be nice to your mama. Oh, he's always nice to his mama. He loves his mama. <clears throat> I don't know. I've been in a, in a room with her for about seven hours. Ago, we have so literally we'll been sitting in this room um, since about <laughs> 11 o'clock today. I cut out stuff on my blowforge and I painted and got, got orders ready. And he cut out a sign for someone and he painted it. And we have been uh, literally in this room probably since 11 o'clock today. And then we went and got showers so we could get ready to craft with you guys tonight. Hey, Graham. Hey, Kelly and Rochelle. Thank you for sprinkling. Yeah, y'all sprinkle. Oh, good, Sylvia. You got your package today. Hey, Carol. <clears throat> okay, guys. So, we're going to do just a little simple craft tonight. I saw where some of y'all tried the buttons. Um, I saw right before I got on, a lady tried the buttons with her grandkids, and the little girl made the buttons in the little jar from last night, and it looks so, so good. So, I hope y'all try that. And um, I know y'all's craft list is getting longer and longer and longer. So when you can get out and get stuff, you'll have all this stuff to do and to buy and to make and all the fun stuff. And um, But I can tell you, I have a lot of it right here. So I have a big stash. <clears throat> so anyway, hey, know. Tiffany from um, Tiffany and Kathy and Bobby. Thank you, Bobby, for sprinkling. So guys, we are going to have a little giveaway tonight. Um... We are going to give away a little sign. I don't want to show up to y'all yet. But um, uh, for everybody that sprinkles tonight, we're going to go back and pick the, you know, do a random thing like we did last time and just pick a random person that uh, wins the little sign tonight. So if you will, will sprinkle, I almost said the word. Did you, did, you put, did you show them the, show, the sign? <clears throat> no, I'm not going to show it yet. Why? Because it was a surprise. Well, you got to have them be anticipated about it through the whole thing. Well, I'll show them to him in a few minutes. Oh, I just got a little excited. <laughs> He's excited. Okay, <coughs> so what we're going to do tonight, um, thank you for sprinkling have those buttons, and you gave me a great idea. Good, I'm glad, I'm glad. Uh, I want to see the pictures of y'all's stuff. You know, I am I need to open up a community on my page so y'all can post stuff there. Um, I need to do that, actually, because <clears throat> everybody's sending me pictures and stuff, and I love seeing all the pictures. And um, it just blesses my heart, and it's just awesome to see how... You take your own spin on things and can, you know, take what I show you and then just run with it and do your own colors and different things and your kids do them and it's just awesome. It just blesses my heart. <coughs> um, let's see. Thank you for sprinkling. Yo, what up, Troy? Okay. So this is a Dollar Tree little dish towel that I got. And I know it's backwards, guys. I'm working on that. I'm actually probably going to get an iPhone so I can do everything the right way and turn it around. But it says, party like a pineapple. And when I saw it, I just thought it was so cute and it looks like a party. It's got the little banner on it. And I think it's just really, really cute. Um, he's all dressed up in his little sunglasses. He's ready for summer. So I thought it screamed summer. So I had to do something with him. <clears throat> And, of course, my thirst, first thought was to make a pillow out of it and do all that. But I thought, no, I'm not going to do that. I'm going to make a little sign out of him. So what I'm going to do is, this is actually a sign from uh, Valentine's Day from the Dollar Tree that I've had in my stash. So 
I went ahead and took a sanding block and I sanded all of the glitter off because, and that was a hot mess because the glitter goes everywhere. <clears throat> so I'm, I just sanded it off just so I can get rid of some of it, but I'm actually going to use the back side. <clears throat> so I'm going to take off the little string hang thing and it just has these little shoelace little things and you can just poke them right back through the hole and take that off. Hey Jane, hey Kathy, hey, maybe. Hey Jane. So I'm just taking that little off and I'll put it to the side. So now we just have this. But like I said, it had glitter all over these little words and I just took my little sanding block and got it off and it, it makes a mess. I'm just gonna warn you up front. So I'm gonna, um, we're gonna put this on this side. But first, I'm actually gonna paint this white because if you lay this, it's just a little thin cloth. And if you lay it on the side, you can kind of see the brown a little through there. I know you probably can't see it on the camera, but you can see the brown a little bit and I don't want that. So I'm actually just gonna put a layer of chalk paint over it. So that's what I'm gonna do now. And Colin's just gonna sit here and watch. So y'all sprinkle, sprinkle. <clears throat> Okay, so I'm just getting my chalk paint, and I'm going to put a little bit out there. Colin actually got to paint with chalk paint today. It was his first time painting with this paint, so he, I had to show him how it's done because it dries really quickly, and if you don't just keep moving with your brush, oh, this over here will be dry by the time you get over there because it dries pretty quickly. So he, he learned how to use the chalk paint today. Yeah, Sylvia makes a big old mess. That glitter, oh my gosh. And I, I just don't think you can ever get rid of it. As I say, it's the herpes of craft supplies because you can't get rid of it. <laughs> you can't believe I said that, can you, Colin? It is. <clears throat> it gets everywhere. They'll tell you. Hey, Brittany. Is the towel trip? No, it's like a, um, it actually said on the tag, like a flower sack cloth. That's what, it's really thin. So it's not terry cloth. So it's like a little tea, whoops, like a little tea towel sack, like a flower, they call it flower sack. That, that's what the tag actually said. And I knew when I saw it, I was like, I gotta have that. Hey, Kathy. Hey, Linda. <clears throat> Colin, you can show them what you did today. Well, it's, is, are they watching? I, I don't think they're watching. No, I don't think he's watching. So tell, to tell Paige, so if she's watching, he can't see. So he's going to show y'all what he made today. While I'm sitting here painting, he's going to entertain. <clears throat> All right. So my girlfriend's dad's birthday is actually today. I'm not here for it. I'm up here with my dear old mom here. So I uh, got her to cut If he's out. watching, just look away. <laughs> yeah. Paige, if your dad is watching, <clears throat> please do not let him see this. Big surprise. So, I got mom to cut me out something on the Glow Forge, and I've been painting it since about 11 today. True. So, I finished, True story. It, I finished it about 6 o'clock Central Time, so put a lot of work into it. So, he's actually a really big Miami Dolphins fan, and I'm a Alabama fan, and most of y'all, I, I don't know if y'all know, but uh, Alabama had two guys drafted to Miami. So, I oh, actually... Oh, he's a Miami fan now. So, I cut him out a... <clears throat> Miami Dolphins, it's backwards, but a Miami Dolphins sign, and I painted it myself. He did. So, I did this did. all by myself. He used the Waverly White chalk paint and everything. He's he's yep. a, he's a pro with the chalk paint now. And I don't know sure. if y'all can see it, but it gets pretty tedious in there, so I guess I inherited something from my mom. Yeah, he did. <laughs> yes, he so, did. It looks really good. I'm proud of it. He's really proud, so... I mean, we have been literally sitting in here all day, and that sign, he's he said a, a few words over it while he was painting, <laughs> so, yeah. but he's proud of it. Just about lost my religion, but it's okay. <laughs> it's okay. It's part of crafting. you got to say some ugly stuff sometimes, or try not to, or bite your tongue or something, because um, yeah, it gets, uh, especially when you burn yourself with a hot glue gun, you're just, whoo. Say some, say some stuff or try not to. So I'm just giving this a coat, guys, just because I don't want the brown to show through. So I'm just kind of, I'm almost done. So what did y'all do today? Y'all say an awesome job. Thanks, guys. I appreciate it. <laughs> and Kaylee, I, we're not real sure about that yet. What? Uh, we'll have to see what the future in store for that. What? She asked if uh, 
my girlfriend was going to go with Texas to me, with me. Oh, okay. So, I got to get myself <laughs> planted on the ground before we talk about anything about that. Yeah, he's going all by himself. He doesn't, he doesn't know anybody. But they've been dating, what, two years? Yep. Two yeah, years, two March years. 17th. That's her birthday. Yep. We lost Tom Brady. Or March and Lost Tom Brady to the, what's that say, to the Bucks? What's that say? Yeah. Buccaneers? We lost Tom Brady and Gronk to the Bucks. Yeah. Who's Gronk? His last name is Gronk? No, his last name is Gronkowski. His name is Rob Gronkowski. Well, well he... I'd rather say Gronk, too, than Gronkowski. <laughs> Okay, all right. But he's going to Tampa Bay. So. See, Colin, you have to kind of move fast with this stuff. He found out because if you don't move fast, it um, it gets tacky, and especially if you're painting a big surface, it, it'll it it goes pretty quickly. And so I had to dip his paint his brush in a little bit of water at some point because it gets all dried up on your on your brush. She, you act, see him shaking she, his head she head? acts like she did the whole thing. <laughs> I'm just saying, I told you, I told you how to do it. I didn't do the whole thing. You did it. I just kind of showed you the tips of the trade with the chalk paint because it uh, gets all tacky and stuff. So I'm only going to put one coat and I'm going to see, I got my white chalk paint. Here's the other side. I just didn't care about covering all that up because it's going to be the back. I'm not going to see it. So there's the, um, that sign. I'm going to turn on my handy dandy little fan and we're going to let it go. <clears throat> so while that's drying, so there's the towel, if you didn't see it. It's just a little, like a little cotton flower sack, little towel. And I'm going to cut him out. And see, then I'm going to have this cute little side, too, to do something with. I don't know what. So, y'all want to see what the what the giveaway thing is? Ready? Okay, so I, this is what I did today. I did paint something and make something. So, I cut this out on my laser cutter, and um, I painted it. So, this is what I'm giving away. Isn't that just the cutest? Hey, Judy from Arkansas. You painted some rocks, Sharice. I paint rocks, too. But this is the actual um, little sign that I'm giving away. And whoever wins it, I'm going to give them the choice of the one that I've painted or one that's totally raw and not put together that you can actually paint yourself and assemble it. Um, I have this on my web my website. Um, if you'll go to... Uh, www.theturquoisevalentine.com and there's a little button up there that says shop and it'll take you to my shop and this is in my shop but it's it comes unfinished and then you can paint it how you choose okay because as a crafter that's one of my biggest um biggest complaints is i don't have enough there's not enough stuff out there that's unfinished that i can do myself to match my decor and so that's why i'm offering it to other people because you know that's i want to paint stuff and make it my own and, and some of you do too. So this is what I'm actually giving away. It is ten and a half by seven and a quarter, I think. But um, it comes unfinished on my website. But I'm gonna give this one to who it, or, or a raw, a unfinished one to a person who sprinkles. So if you sprinkle, we're gonna randomly pick somebody, and we'll come on and we'll randomly pick somebody and give this away. So or either an unfinished one. So it'll be your choice. Thank you, Kaylee. Thank y'all. So I think it's really cute. This design's been floating around for a while. And I've always wanted a sign like that. And I never have purchased one. So I got one. I mean, now I can cut my own and make my own. Thank you, Christine. <clears throat> yes, Kathy, you got the gnome. Yes. So if you haven't been to my site, you hop on over there. Don't do it now. Just hop on over there uh, when we get off. But um, somebody's going to win that tonight. So let's see if that's dry. It's almost dry. All right. I think it's cute, too. Thank you, guys. I appreciate that. Sprinkle, sprinkle, sprinkle. Okay. So, so we're going to use some Mod Podge. That's what I'm going to put on the sign. I was going to do the uh, adhesive spray, and I would probably get too wild with it because it gets everywhere. So, I'm just going to use Mod Podge. So, um, when that dries, we're going to do that. But we're going to um, we're gonna add... Thank you, Janet. Thank you, Cynthia. We're going to add a little something, something to the sign. To make it a little a little special so this came from the dollar tree also they had yarn at my dollar tree i was so excited and it's called just yarn and i don't know what worsted is that says worsted underneath there i don't know what that means i guess it's the type of yarn that it is worsted w-o-r-s-t-e-d if y'all can tell me what that means i don't crochet or anything i've tried god bless that it's not my craft but the worsted i don't know what worsted means that's crazy. I don't know what that is. 
spent the day in the afternoon organizing my craft room. Well, good, Kathy. I like to organize my craft room, too. But anyway, so I got this yarn, and it went perfect with the green on the pineapple. So I thought I'm going to make some tassels to go with the bottom, and I'm going to show y'all how I do it. Um, so I've already made three. Okay, did you see that? I just put that right off in that paint. Just cut it off. <laughs> I just wiped it off. Newman's trying to order me around. Uh, Newman? Uh, I don't like it. Newman, when you come up, we're going to put you here on live, and you're going you're gonna to do some stuff. That's one of our friends. <laughs> Means light. Oh, it means light yarn, James. Is that what that means? It's real stretchy, though. I don't know. It's, it's different. But I'm going to make some tassels, and I've already made three of them, so I wouldn't be on here all night making tassels. But I'm going to show y'all. i got to make two more, and um, I'm going to show you how I do that. So you can use a piece of cardboard. You can use a piece of board. You can use something that's stiff that's not going to bend. This is just a wooden tag. That I've cut out with my laser cutter and I just grabbed it and it was the perfect size that I needed so that I just grabbed that because I like this width this width in case you need to know it's two is three and it's I'm sorry it's two and a quarter no two and three quarters wide is what I'm using but you can do whatever you want I've used cardboard before um, so you can do whatever you want and then I'm just going to I like to start and put my my yarn down here at the bottom because it's gonna eventually be one of those little you know the strings in the tassel so i put it down like that oh look, look carol, you're so nice look at carol's all fancy and getting a link to my shop okay so here is the how i start i hold it down at the bottom flush with the bottom and then i'm just going to wrap about 20 times and you know you just sit there and go three four five six seven eight Nine, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20. And I'm going to do one just because. So there I got, I did about 20 times. That's how many I did on these. So actually it was like 21. So that's how full it makes it. So there's that. And then I'm just going to cut it off flush at the bottom. Okay. So we have this. And like I said, you can use cardboard. And we, you can use, uh, this is just a piece of wood that I had on my table and I grabbed it and started wrapping. So that's what I did. Um, this is two and three quarters inch wide. So that's, that's how, you know, that's what I'm using. But you can do whatever. Um, hey, Barbara. So then that's what I did. So now I'm going to cut a piece uh, about right there, okay? No measurement. I'm just cutting a piece. And I'm actually going to slide it underneath all of my strings. Just like so. See, I got it underneath those. And then I'm going to pull it out a little bit. And if you can't see because the comments at the bottom of the screen, you can just swipe the screen and the comments will go away and you can see, kind of see what I'm doing down here at the bottom of the screen. Um, if you don't know that. So uh, here's my two strings that I slid under there and I'm going to pull them up here to the very top. Okay. And I'm going to tie a knot. Because we're actually going to glue these tassels onto the sign, I'm thinking. <laughs> so I'm just um, tying a little knot, just like so. So now we have our strings. That's my little strings from my knot. And we have a knot right here at the top. And that's going to hold it all together, okay? Just like that. Craig's watching. Craig's watching. <laughs> okay. So... He's trying to support his wife. And play cornhole. And play cornhole. Okay. All right, so there it is. I hadn't cut the bottom yet, okay? So now I'm going to get another piece of yarn, and I'm just going to kind of eyeball it, okay? About like that. <laughs> so this yarn, and I'm going to leave me a tail about like this, okay? And then I'm going to start wrapping. Hey, Leanne. Hey, Leanne. And I'm going to start, um, I'm just going to take it, and I'm going to kind of pull it tight, if y'all can see. And I'm just kind of wrapping it around two or three times, okay? And then I have this tail that I started with. And then I have this little tail. That's the end of what I just wrapped around. What are you laughing about? Denise. <laughs> Denise. Hey, Denise! Oh, yeah, I got a good-looking co-worker, don't I? <laughs> no, I'm no co-worker. I am the supervisor of this operation. <laughs> co-worker I gotta keep he's, her, a, he's keep a CEO he thinks okay 
So I'm just, I just tied a knot. So I just wrapped it around about two or three times. And then here's my little, those are my tails I still have. But see, I just wrapped it around two or three times. And I've got my little tails and I'm just going to snip those off, okay? So now we have this cute little, this cute little tassel. But I got to cut it first, don't I? I forgot that part. So I'm just going to take my scissors and I'm going to try to stick it through all of those loops. And I'm just going to snip it. And I got them all. So there's our tassel. That's how, how you do it. Isn't it cute? You can do it with jute. You can do it with ribbon. You can do it with, you know, any kind of string. Baker's twine. Any kind of twine. It'd be great. So I just picked it up because it was green and it matched the towel. So now we have four. What are they saying? Desperate. <laughs> Dylan has the supervisor. Oh, my Lord. Okay. So I'm going to do the same thing again so you can watch one more time. Colin, you want to do it? Did you pay attention? Did you know how to do this? Man, you're not good and well. <laughs> Be the ugliest tassels you ever did see. <laughs> okay, so I'm going to do this again. I'm going to start down here, and I'm going to lay my piece, you know, even with the bottom, and I'm going to go around 20 times. 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20, and then I'm going to go one more just because. I'm liking comments. Oh, okay. He's like he's doing the comments. You're not talking to everybody while I'm trying to count. Well, I'm liking do you, comments. Do you not want to do the tassel because you can't count? Here, let me hold that up. I hold that. Now you're a prop. You're not the you're not the supervisor anymore. You're a prop. Oh, well, I'm trying to get you. Uh, uh, I don't want to say the word. <laughs> he's a prop. Okay, so there's my wrapping around, and like when I when I come around the backside and I. I always try to snip it off even with the bottom because it's going to be one of the little tassel parts too. So then I'm going to cut a piece about like that, okay? It doesn't matter because you're going to end up cutting some of this off anyway. And then I'm going to take my yarn. It's my little tag I have here. <laughs> this is what I grabbed to make one with. But it worked out good. Like I said, you could use cardboard, whatever you have, and that will um, help you make a tassel. Um, they make tassel makers. You can do that too. So I put my string. I put my string under there. He's the model for the Price is Right show. He is over here cracking up, Kathy. You gotta do like this, and you gotta do like this. So you gotta, you gotta go. Whoa. Ooh. Oh. <laughs> so you gotta do that. A brand new car. It's a brand new car. It's not a used car. It's a brand new car. It's always brand new. I would hope it's brand new. Like some bum on the street's been on it. It's got cigarette burns all in the seat. I would hope not. It's, it's brand new. Okay. So I slipped my string underneath my, my, all this, all the little wraps that I did. And I'm pulling it up here to the top. Just like so. You see that? And then I'm going to tie it. a tie a knot. So to hold it all together. But now if I was actually going to tie this onto something then I probably would do it a little different, but I'm going to end up cutting all these little ends off, and then we're going to glue it to the sign. Hey, Amanda. All right, so I got our knot, okay? And then we're going to slide it off. Just don't do it too tight with whatever you're wrapping it around, because if you do it too tight, when you go to take that stuff off, it, mm, you, you might say some ugly words. Okay, so then we have this, my little, our little top part that we tied in the knot. And I'm just going to cut some like that. <laughs> I'm just an eyeballer, okay? So I'm going to leave a tail like that. And I'm going to hold it on my little, my little bundle right here. And then I'm just going to wrap around and pull them it tight at the same time a few times. Just like this. I don't know how many times that was, okay? Just wherever I kind of like it. Hi, Miss Amanda. How are you? And so, hey, um, <laughs> I just got to show everybody the product. Okay. So anyway, so I'm tying that a knot. Yeah, we're giving that away to a to a sprinkler tonight. Okay. So there I tied it in a knot, what I wrapped around. And then I'm going to just clip those off kind of close. They're not going to go anywhere. I might just, I might just make it like that. Okay. Then I'm going to cut all my loops. 
See, Colin, you didn't want to try one? I bet they want to see you try one. And then I'm going to stick my scissors all the way through the loops, and I'm just going to cut it, okay? Hey, Sissy. Hey, Sissy. Stephanie. Oh, <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Stephanie, I got Colin on here. He's my, uh, he thinks he's the executive producer or something. But anyway, so there's our little tassel. So now I have one, two, three. I like that. Kathy said, four, and it's a brand new sign. Five. And it's a brand new sign. Yeah. Do y'all ever catch when they say that? It's like, it's a brand new car. Does the model come with the sign? I mean, if you want it to. <laughs> okay. So that's, if you're just hopping on, if you sprinkle, we're going to go back through everybody that sprinkles tonight. And you can either, you're going to, we're going to randomly pick somebody with a random generator thing. And you're either going to get the finished product or you can get one that's unfinished that I'll send to you and you can decorate how you choose. So that's what I'm, I'm giving away. Here you hold it. Here the top. Okay. So I got all my five tassels. Okay. So I made three ahead of time. So there's five. And I'm like, why is there a remote control in the middle of the table? <laughs> Maybe I want okay. to watch TV. I don't know. The remote's sitting out here in the middle of the table. Y'all probably wonder if we're fixing to watch television or Guys, something. Guys, grocery games is on. That's my favorite. Oh my goodness. Okay. Let me turn the fan off. Okay. So let me get my little towel out in case y'all didn't see it. That's the cutest thing ever. Party like you're a pineapple. I think it's so cute. Okay. So I'm going to put it over my sign and I'm just going to kind of see. And see, doesn't that look better since I painted it white under there? Yeah, it don't okay. show through. Yeah, I didn't want the brown to show through on my sign. So if you're just hopping on, I took a, took a Valentine's Day sign from the Dollar Tree, sanded all the glitter off, and I'm using the back side, which I painted white. So it won't show through my towel. I just had to get that glitter off there. 45 shares. Awesome. But yeah, I can go back and look at craft oh, exhibit CEO officer. craft exhibit exhibit officer. I like that. That's kind of cool. You need to make okay. me an apron that says that. <laughs> so when you come up here, you can do this? Yeah. Can you see Chase doing this? No. That's my other son. Chase. He ain't going to get on here. No. He's like mom. Okay. He wouldn't know what to do with himself. Where's the center? I'm trying He'd to find center. Cry. Okay, so I got to tell y'all a funny, because I've told y'all this before, and I told Carol this, and she, like, laughed hilariously at me, but um, this had, like, wrinkles in it where it was folded in the store. So I take my flat and iron for my hair, and I actually ironed out the wrinkles in this towel with my flat iron. <laughs> so <laughs> she's like, you should do that on the live tonight. I was like, no. Nah think so okay so I'm just trying to center him up and like I said I'm just eyeballing how I want him to be on my sign Bob Try wants to know how pineapple parties I don't know <laughs> <laughs> that dry sense of humor That's good so good question what good question we'll have to get back with you on that on the pineapple question yeah. I don't know how a pineapple parties I don't know that's my that's my brother and then my sister-in-law. Okay, so I'm trying to get this straight. I wonder if these little lines are straight. Does that look straight to you? I know y'all think, my gosh, she's smoothing that thing out, but I can't decide if it's straight. That looks straight, don't Straight it? as an arrow. Okay, so I gotta figure out how I'm gonna do this. Am I gonna flip it over and draw a line around it and then cut it? I think that's what I'm gonna do. I'm gonna carefully flip it over. It's a flying pineapple now. Okay. So I got it on the back side because on the other side I got it just like I want it. And I'm going to cheat and I think I'm going to um, iron hack. That's right. I didn't want to break my iron and iron board out. So I'm just going to take a Sharpie and I'm basically just going to go around here so I'll know exactly where to cut. Hey, Billy. Hey, Billy. All right. It's cool to keep seeing y'all, you guys that come on here all the time and you know, and I get to know you as a person and, you know, try to have a little community here because I like to talk with like-minded people that like to do crafts. And um, it's just cool that I start recognizing your names and I know who you are and where you're from. And I try to remember, where did I get the towel? I got it at Dollar Tree. So there it is if you want to see it again. It is so cute. It was a dollar. And it's like a flower sack. It's real thin cotton. So I'm going to actually, these are my, don't touch these scissors, scissors. These are my Ginger uh, dressmaker scissors. These are the best things. They cut fabric like butter. Um, 
And you don't think scissors make a difference when you're cutting fabric? You ain't never cut a paper, cut fabric with this. They are awesome. I think I got mine at Joann's or something when they have their... Where did you get the towel again? Dollar Tree. Dollar Tree. Dollar Tree for a dollar. Everything we're using tonight, I got at the Dollar Tree. Um, even the Mod Podge. Except for the white paint, I didn't get that at Dollar Tree. But even the yarn, the yarn, the green yarn came from Dollar Tree. The sign came from Dollar Tree. The, this came from Dollar Tree. Um... I'm all about Dollar Tree, but I have a small dollar bush up here in my room. Do I not have a dollar bush? I do, Donna Colin. Where, what Up now? in this room, I have a dollar bush, Donna. I've got some if, stuff. If that's what you want to call hoarding, then. It's not hoarding. Y'all tell him it's not hoarding. There, see, you're going to, you're going to lose, um, you're going to lose, uh, people's respect because you're calling us hoarders. Going to lose some fan, a fan base. So guys, I'm not, I'm just trying to cut it out the best I can. I'm not really, because it's got little indentions where the little, bo like, little fake boards are. But, um, you tell us why you think it's hoarding, Colin. Does this look like something that's on the episode of Hoarders? Look at all this behind us. That doesn't look like an episode of Hoarders. But they ain't seen the rest of the room. It's not a mess. And or the closet. It's organized in the closet. It's all organized. I know exactly where everything is. Yeah, it's like it's just thrown in there and I shut the door real fast. <laughs> yeah. No? Yeah, it is. It's ordered up. But, okay. What, okay, when you have, okay, I can understand, you know, when you know where something is. You know what I'm saying? When you put something somewhere, you know exactly where it is. Mm -hmm. You can search this room. I've seen you do it for three or four hours. And one I have, it. because I put it somewhere now where that, it's not supposed to be. When it gets that bad, no. you got a problem. I don't. You lose your car keys and you don't know where they are and you're you're <laughs> so I don't want to hear that but where are my keys? I haven't okay. done that in a long time. Okay. Because I, I bought you that thing for Christmas. Well it died. It died. It died about a year ago. Alright. I'm almost through cutting it out. You need when you craft you need lots of stuff. She you puts do. lots of stuff into it, uh You into I have a lot of stuff in this little bitty room right here. But it's organized stuff. Crafters are collectors, not hoarders. We save things for another day. That's right, Linda. So there, I cut it out. Isn't it cute? It's going to be so cute. It actually did really well. I know. These scissors are the bomb. I'm telling you. Okay. See, there's glitter still everywhere. Okay, so this is what it's going to look like once I get it on here. So yeah, I started just to make a pillow out of this little dish towel. And then I was like, nope. It's too cute. I want to make a sign. Because it's white and I have boys and it would have been dirty. So, okay. So, this is what it's going to look like when I get done. Look how cute that is. Already like a pineapple. However that is. Leave it to my brother to say that. Okay. So, now we will use it all eventually. That's right. And when, if I don't, when I'm gone, you get to clean it out. <laughs> so, don't throw it away. And don't sell it for what you think it's worth. It's probably worth more than that. So this is my Mod Podge from Dollar Tree. It came from there too. So I'm just going to, I hope this and chalk paint goes well together. We're gonna find out. But you gotta get really good on the edges and this stuff dries really fast, Colin. <laughs> I like Mod Podge. Hey Deidre, hey Peggy, thanks. I'm trying. You to talk about your sign again? Yep, if you, um. Sprinkle, everybody that sprinkles tonight, we're going to pick somebody at random. Don't get in my way. <laughs> I'm not. Don't get in my space. Um, We're going to pick somebody at random, and you can either choose from getting the sign that's finished, or you can get one that's unfinished. And um, so, because I sell stuff that's unfinished in my store, if um, you can go to the turquoisevalentine.com, and there's a little button at the top that says shop, and it'll take you to my Shopify store. Uh, the link for that is in the comments. Yes. Carol, Carol, Carol posted. posted it in the links. And I can link it when I get off. But um, it um, if you want to go look at my sh my shop, you can. I have some other things for 4th of July. You can grab those little stars right there, Sean. Um, These? Yeah. And so, and guys, I know that y'all liked my scissors that I showed the other day. And I'm tr actually trying to find a way to cut those scissors. But see, these are in my store, too. They're, these are finished. 
but they're actually stacked and that's cut out right there and I put scrapbook paper in the middle. Those are in my shop too for my tear tray for, for uh, 4th of July. Okay, so, all right, so I'm just kind of stretching my fabric on my sign and trying to get it all fixed. And what, another thing about me painting it white is that you're not gonna be able to tell if I don't get it like totally lined up right. And then I'm just gonna kind of smooth it down and get all the bubbles out. Maybe I can get it to stick, that to stick. I'll put a little more right here. Now I gotta put a little more everywhere. That towel kind of soaks it up too. And you can also go over the top with the Mod Podge and it'll kind of give it a, um, it'll seal it. So you can do that too. And I may end up doing it, especially if I'm gonna put it on my door where it's not, um, it's kind of humid outside. All right, so I'm getting all that on there. Got one more place over here that needs some more. Well, let's see. Thank you, Kelly. Thank y'all for sprinkling. Okay, what are you doing? He's over here on his phone texting or looking at comments or I'm something. I'm looking at comments. I don't want to do it on. Okay. In front of people? Yep. All right, let's get a little. Make sure you get your edges good when you do this because it'll curl, it'll come off the edges. Look how stinking cute this is. Isn't it cute? And it was a dollar towel on a dollar sign. Okay. Now, I'm going to trim this off the bottom. I cut it a little bit. I'm just going to run my scissors around the bottom and get that off. See? Isn't that cute? Isn't he cute? He just look, he just makes you smile when you look at it. Sealed some napkins with my Podge and I've never done it before. So cute. It goes by fast. Hey Mary Ann from Davenport, Florida. Where do I get my scissors? Um, I got them years ago at Joann's. They're Ginger. I don't know if you can see that or not. They're, ooh, blinding y'all. They're Ginger scissors. Um, they're German made, I think, but they're for, I use them only for fabrics. They got this little fabric tag on there. They're only for fabric, but I'll tell you what, they cut like butter. They cut fabric wonderfully. If you work with fabric and you don't have a pair of Gingers, you need some, because they're awesome. Um, the raw sign, I think it's 15 for all the pieces and you get, it's raw when you get it. But, um, this one's painted. This is, I just showed it how it can be done. And I'm going to either give this one or a raw one, unfinished one, away to uh, somebody who sprinkles tonight. So, you got your happy mail today. Yay! Susan, I'm glad. I can't wait to see what you do with them. Okay. So, there is that. So, now I've got all of our little tassels that we're going to do. So, what I'm going to do is I'm going to put them on the bottom. See, you gotta have some tassels to party. The ones, the ones on the shelf. This, the stars. There's three of these stars, like this. Is she talking about? about the scissors on the shelf? Or the scissors? I think she's talking about. The scissors. Oh, Carrie, you're so sweet. Okay, so there it is. I'm gonna put the tassels on the bottom, and I'm trying to decide if I'm gonna just glue them to the back. I think I'm gonna glue them to the back. Is the summer sign in pieces, and then you put it together? Yes, it's all in pieces. And you paint this how you want to paint it. I mean, even the little letter, these little, see, they're kind of off the, off the sign. They're like 3D. So, um, I painted the whole sign, painted this, painted the letters, painted the pineapple. I mean, the pineapple, <laughs> the popsicles. And then I just, I glued each one on with, uh, actually, I used uh, super glue, gel super glue from Dollar Tree. And they're not going anywhere. But it was very, very simple. Um, I use makeup brushes and I dab the paint on the letters and stuff and it's wonderful. So I just turned the sign over guys, okay? And I'll actually turn it this way so you can see. Um, I got all my little tassels and I'm gonna glue them to the back, but I'm just gonna lay them out and see, once I got through, see where I wanna put them. Like that. Okay. So I can space them out, right? And I'm just gonna glue them to the back and then if you want to, if some people like to finish their products on the back, their, their, pro, their projects on the back, you could put a brown piece of paper over this when you're done and it would be fine. Um, but I, you know, I'm not real worried about the back because it's probably going to go right back here. He's just too stinking cute. I want to put him in my craft room. Is that five? What kind of paint? 
Uh, just craft paint, regular craft paint. I painted the back. The back is actually uh, chalk paint from Waverly. It's uh, this is steel is the color, and then I just uh, white brushed it over with some uh, white Waverly white. But all these colors are that's just random chalk uh, craft paint from Walmart, Apple Barrel, or whatever. I just buy whatever. So I'm getting them spaced out. Can y'all see, guys? If you can't see and you got comments at the bottom, just swipe. And you'll get rid of the comments. You want to show them my scissors? There's my scissors. I'm actually trying to figure out to cut out, cut out some scissors. Because I know y'all liked them. I bought this pair and painted them the other day. If you didn't see the post. But um, they're going to go on my craft room wall. But I'm actually going to try to get a file. and or, or make a file. And I'm going to try to cut out the scissors. Because um, a lot of people have asked about them. Messaged me about them. So I'm going to try to cut out some scissors with my laser cutter. And y'all can have your own scissors. But no, they don't work. Because who asked me? Somebody asked, Somebody did they work? work. Uh-oh, watch your phone. No, Chase asked. Oh, Chase. My other son asked, did they work? Like, did they go in? No, no they they're just work. stationary. Not work, like cut. But he wanted to know if they moved. No, they're just solid stationary. So I'm just going to put me a little puddle of hot glue right here. Where's my little finger protectors? Here we go. My little fingers. These come from Dollar Tree too. Scissors are adorable. I know I love the scissors. And I just... Did you finish your pegboard? I did. I and I showed it. Um, let me do the middle one. I showed it on a live, but I'll show y'all at the end what my pegboard looks Cut like. Cons over with your non-working scissors. Ah. Uh. He needs his hair I don't cut. think I would let her touch my hair with actual work. No, you don't scissors. want me cutting hair. I'd rather not have bald spots. I cut my hair when I was a little girl one time, like whacked my bangs off, like the day before school pictures, and my mom about had a heart attack. I did that too. You were just playing around and went snip. That was in the first grade. I put a tattoo in my hair. One of those little arm tattoos? Yep. I know, Cynthia, the paint is, at Walmart, it's in, it's crazy. The whole, the whole paint aisle is just nothing. And the fabric aisle is even worse <laughs> because um, people are making masks. And so the whole fabric aisle is just, it's just bare. It looks like the toilet paper aisle. Exactly what it looks like. I don't know if y'all's toilet paper <laughs> is still that bad, but um, it's, uh, our toilet paper aisle is still just nothing. By the time they get it out, off the pallet and go load it up it's gone and i don't know what the deal is does everybody not have enough toilet paper already i mean what are they using this toilet paper for uncle bob said you're an engineer you can get those scissors to work nope not touching my scissors <laughs> ask her about cutting my cowlick off when she was a kid oh i forgot about that oh my gosh <laughs> look if he's gonna start bringing up stuff from when i was a kid then I'm gonna tell him he can't watch. <laughs> <laughs> Bang. Don't be talking about stuff I did when I was a kid. Blocked. Yeah, <laughs> no. <laughs> so I made a trip to Hobby. Well, Billy, ours opened up, and uh, I was intending on going by there Friday, but I didn't because him and my other son were almost here, and um, I just came, went ahead and came on home. I didn't even. I did not even. Um, Go to Hobby Lobby, believe it or not. But Shocking. I, I called to see if they were open because I heard they were. And I called and the man <laughs> answered the phone and he goes, Hobby Lobby, how can I help you? And I said, are y'all open? He goes, yes, ma'am. We opened at 9 o'clock this morning. And I was like, oh, praise Jesus. And he started dying out laughing. And I said, I have missed y'all so bad. And he just kept laughing at me <laughs> like I was in some insane craft crafting lady. Uh -huh. But... um. He was like, okay, well, we opened the doors at nine. And I was like, oh, thank you, Jesus. And <laughs> I know he probably thought I was so stupid. And uh, I think the adjective you used there to describe yourself is pretty, pretty on point. <laughs> yeah, stupid. No, crazy crafting lady. <laughs> crazy, crazy crafting lady. That's what it is. I, I know he thought, oh, my gosh, these people are crazy. They coming in here to get 80% off Easter stuff. That's really not why I need to go. I, I got to get a couple of things. But they have paint because the doors have been locked and shut. So they have craft paint. <laughs> all right. So I got all the tassels on. 
Um, somebody said that they're, to they're from Ohio and that uh, their Walmart put their toilet paper in layaway so you can only get one pack per person. Good God. That's wild. That's wild. All right, look how cute that is. Doesn't that look happy? I think it's so cute. All right, so now i got to figure out how I'm going to hang it. So is everybody... Ohio, that's nuts. What are they doing? So I'm just going to try to poke a hole through here without killing myself. Hey, my mom. Hey, Mary Beth. All right. That's why I got this mat down here so I won't tear up my table. Are okay. You gonna, are you going to hang it with the yarn? Or are you gonna I don't do know because it's, it's real... See how it's like... Yeah, it's kind of flimsy. It's kind of stretchy. But, I mean, I guess I could. It's not... I don't know. It'll be fine. You sure? Yeah. Do they have paint? So it's 50% off. I think... What did I see? It was, I ain't gonna be able to get that yarn through that hole. That's what's gonna be the problem. What about your little things you're using for flower, flower wire? Mm, yeah. That, what, those? No. That's too thin. That's too, that is not even gonna go through that hole. Carol said, so cute. You have my address. <laughs> oh, look, there we go. See, I'm just poking it in with my scissors. That's working. Please don't cut yourself. I'm not cutting myself. Okay, so I'm just doing it, doing it like that. And I don't want it too long. It's the one on the shelves now. This, is it this? Or the stars? Or is it the flag over there it's by... It's on the shelves now. I'm not I'm not sure as to what she's referring to. She was to. saying um, something a while ago, and I asked her which one she was talking about, and she gotcha. said, um, on the shelves. Hey, Kia. Hey, Lori. That's... Thank y'all for sprinkling. Like I said, if you sprinkle tonight, you are going to either get this sign or you're going to get an unfinished version. We're going to let whoever wins um, pick. And so it's all cut out of wood, laser laser cutter wood. How am I trying to say that? Um, and it's, see how it's raised off of everything? And you can get the unfinished one and you can finish it however you want to finish it. Or you can choose to get the one that's finished if, you, if we pick your name. So please sprinkle. And sprinkle means, where's my thing? This is what sprinkle means, okay? So if you're new and you don't know, that's what it means. Um, Facebook doesn't like us to say that word. I look at Kim saying Southern Miss to the top. Oh. Yeah, Kim, he's graduating. It's supposed to be this year, but you know. Okay. Well, I am graduating. Well, well you I, are, well, but they're not it. having a graduation. <laughs> okay. So I'm trying to see how 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 I want my thing like that. So I'm just gonna glue them bad boys down. Just, I'm gonna just put some glue over the string and let it sit. Now if I was hanging up something more heavier than this, I sir I would be doing something more than just gluing it down. Thank you, Donna. Yeah, they're they're holding his graduation in August. So. He was gonna be working in Dallas by then, so. Uh no, this Iowa. this this is in Iowa. Uh, this is Southern, Southern Miss. Miss. So our logos are actually very, very similar. similar. They were they were so similar that there was actually a problem. So Southern mm -hmm. Miss had to change their original logo so it wouldn't look that similar to Iowa's. Hey, Davida. So. All right, so I'm just letting that dry. I just put the little globs of hot glue on the back to hold up my sign. And I'm not going to pull it up yet because it's not dry. But isn't that just the cutest? Don't that just look so happy? It looks like little hula girls down at the bottom. I was thinking the same thing. <laughs> Were you thinking really the same thing? thing? We really think the same thing all the time. Um, isn't that cute? I'm trying to... Yeah, I knew she graduated two years ago. That's awesome. So I wonder if I should put... Should I hang one here? Hang one A tassel. Oh, Lord, look. It's unstuck to my mat. <laughs> This is what you call a crafting fail right here, ladies and gentlemen. You are getting to see a crafting fail because Lee stuck it down to her <laughs> cutting board. And now I have glue. Oh, yeah. That's what a, cl a crafting fail looks like when you don't wait to the glue to dry and then you pull it up and it sticks to everything. But yeah. never fail. I'm going to fix it. <laughs> that's what just happened. I guess I'm a jinx. Oh, you're not a jinx. Look, you're my 
my helper. All right, we just got to do it again. I just laid it down flat and the glue is stuck. Look, you scared me with that thing. I'm like your surgical I'm packing tech. heat. I'm like your surgical tech. Surgical tech. I thought you were the CEO and then you were the executive producer and then I'm you were the prop I'm guy. Now you're the I'm surgical a, tech. Okay. I'm a jack of all trades. Redo. Y'all see this glue right here? It's like stuck to this mat. And this Gorilla Glue is serious. So if you don't use Gorilla Glue glue sticks, I advise you to try them because I wasn't a believer until I tried them and they are awesome. Peggy says, Tassels on says the top would be cute. I think so too while we're waiting for that. True life time. happening. We love it. It is true. I just laid it down and it was stuck. Nothing I was like, oh my gosh. It can never be perfect. All right. So we're going to make tassels again. Except my Got my little tag inside. out. And I'm going to lay it down like that. And then I'm just going to wrap and count at the same time. Three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, 10, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 18, 19, 20, and one. Okay. Then I'm gonna cut it off. Put a knot in the strings and you wouldn't have to do any glue. Yeah, I didn't put, yeah, I guess I could have done that. It's, so, it's like real thin yarn though. This stuff is like real, I don't know, it's weird. But it's a Dollar Tree, it's that whole, this whole thing was a dollar. So I was real proud to find it. And then Colin, they roll my eyes all the time when I always want to go to the Dollar Tree and they're like, oh my gosh, there's a Dollar Tree. What not? So I'm just tying, put my string underneath there like I did earlier. And then I pull it to the top and I'm just tying a knot. And doing it again. Just like that, okay? And then I'm gonna slide it off. Like I said, if you do this around cardboard or something, just don't, just try not to wrap it too tight because then you won't be able to slide it off and you're like, oh, now what do I do? Okay, so right there. And then I'm gonna leave a little tail and I'm gonna put my thumb over here on the tail, just like that. And then I'm just gonna wrap this around a few times pretty tight and just pull it tight. And everybody's got their different way of making tassels. I was just trying to make, you know, quick tassels real fast. Um, just for this little sign. Because I had to make five. Now I'm making six. Wow. My fat fingers keep spelling words wrong. Okay. Cocktail drinks. I might need a cocktail after this. I didn't laid that thing down and stuck to my... You about driving me to get any more. Driving you? Well, you the one that was coming on here with me? Okay. No, I've just been cooped up in a room with you. Yeah, I've been cooped up in a room with him all day. So there it is. And I got to cut my loops. So I'm just going to kind of put my scissors through there. And there it is. And if you have to give it a little haircut, you can do that too. All right. So you think this is dry? No. No. Gosh, it's not set up yet. Look it's at getting it. there. But I can't lay it down because it's going to stick to the table. All right. So here. You better not get your uh, other strings in it. Okay. Yeah. So should I put it? to my apron. Okay. So should I put it there? I know that's backwards to y'all, but or I can put it over here. Look, there's Karen. Karen's on. Hey, Karen. What's up, Taterhead? Or so should I put it like on that? I don't want it to cover up the thing. Where did you get the cloth? It is a um, a dish towel that I cut out. <laughs> it's a di little flower sack dish towel I got from Dollar Tree. Believe it or not, it came from the Dollar Tree. So I'm trying to decide what side. I don't want it to hang in the words, so I've got to kind of... Space it out more to the left. Well, I'm putting it right there on that string. Oh, are you? See? But I don't want it to hang over on the words, so I think I'm going to put it on the side. Or you hold it up, because I don't want it to lay it on the table, because then I'll... Um, so I'm just taking it, and I'm just going to tie it on here, and I want to lay it down, because it, it'll stick to the table again, because that glue's not all the way set up. There we go. Hey, Karen. Yeah, I got Colin crafting with me tonight. I don't All know right. if that's a bad thing or a good thing. <laughs> okay. Oh, so there it don't is. Get you, don't get your string in the glue. We don't want to. It's have, about set up now. We don't want to have another. I guess I just put a big old puddle and it made it where it wasn't set up. Look how cute it is. And I got this one up here. You need another one. Can you put another one over here? Oh, I think that'll be too much. You think that'll be too much? One on each side. Well, one looks. One just kind of looks a little bare. You gotta have him a friend. Okay, hold the signs. I can't lay it down. Okay, we'll make one more and put it on the other side. 
Okay, same thing again. Y'all are getting to learn how to make tassels. Two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen, seventeen. Oh, thanks, Karen. 18, I know. I'm just beautiful. One. <laughs> <laughs> oh. He's he's my um my helper while he's up here. Okay, I just cut a string and I'll slide it under there like we've done other times, and then I pull it to the top. And then I'm going to tie it off because I want to hold them all together. I think it looks cute too, Dawn. It looks precious. And then I'm going to tie another knot. Who's texting you and making fun of you? Because <laughs> you're on here with your mama. How many 22-year-olds do you know would get on there with their mama and crap with their mama? And um, well, go live. At least one. That's me. This one. He's so good to me. Okay. All right. Then I'm going to cut some more. And then I'm going to leave a tail, like I told y'all before, just a little bit of a tail. And I'm going to hold the tail with my my thumb. Why do you laugh every time I say that about no, leaving a tail? I was reading Kevin's oh. comment. Yeah, so I'm, I'm glad I don't. <laughs> Look all, right. At that. all right. So I'm just going to wrap it around a few times. And then I'm just going to tie it with my little tail that I left. I'm just tying it a knot. I wish, I wish you'd space this one out because it kind of blocks the words. But if you angle it like this, it'll, it'll be work. all right. Okay. So there's that. I'm going to cut that off. Somebody said none. Are they talking about the tassels? Oh, uh, they're talking about me. Oh, none. Yeah, yeah, okay. He loves his mom. We've been crafting together for... All kinds of stuff. He he would have the jam up looking at his school projects you've ever seen. I, I, I was telling somebody the other day about the, uh, remember my mold day project for chemistry class? Yes. And you did it in Minecraft. Mold mold. Minecraft. Mm-hmm. Yep. That was cool. That was dope. Okay, silence. So awesome. You'd hear Keith. Wish my son would do so for me. Now, he he doesn't always do so with me, but he, he painted that sign today. You going to show him your sign again in case yeah. they miss it? Um. He cut out, uh, with my laser cutter, he cut out a wood sign today, and he painted it. Look, and we've literally out. been sitting in this room since 11 o'clock today. Yep. Here is the final product. It's I backwards, I know, but... It is backwards, but it's actually correct over here. But he painted all that. Yep. It looks so good. I'm very okay. proud of it. Look at that. i got to cut that line and catch him. Mm -hmm. See, acting like that. Okay, I gotta cut that off. All right, I'm gonna get it fixed. I'm playing Carol like I'm um, playing the hairdresser. She likes to do it and then she turns it around so you can see it. Okay. Look at how cute. I can always trim them off. But look how stinking cute that is. And everything was from the Dollar Tree. The sign, the towel, the, uh, the yarn, and even the Mod Podge was from Dollar Tree. So I think it's just too stinking cute. It looks all happy with the little tassels. That's right, Karen. I'm a jack of all trades. He girl. is a jack of all trades. So I think it's really cute. All right, guys. So um, we're going to hop off in a second, but this is the. You don't want to do it live? I got to go through all the people and write them all down. I can't do it live. Why can't I just go and click on the shares on my phone and then scroll down it? Because I'll put them in the random thing and pick it, and then we'll get on live and pick it. Oh, okay. we're going to go live again? Uh, mate, yeah. Oh, I don't know, but maybe there? in the morning. I don't know. So this is what we're giving away. It's either going to be this finished sign or an unfinished one. If you want it unfinished, because they're in my in my uh, shop unfinished, it's uh, the turquoisevalentine.com, and you can click shop, and it'll take you to my shop. But I sell the unfinished ones, okay? But this one I painted today so I could show you. So the person that we pick that sprinkles is either going to get this one or an unfinished one, whatever their choice is, if they want to paint it themselves. But... So this is what we're doing. So if you'll sprinkle, 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 we'll appreciate it so people can find me and see this, my handsome son over here. <laughs> they can see him, but he's going back home tomorrow, so I won't get to see him. So, but we've been in this room all day today, so I've, um, <laughs> we've had our feel of each other. Now we're probably going to go sit and watch TV. Again. I would like to go live. I actually kind of enjoy it. I know. Fun. Okay, well, fun. if I go write everybody down, well, then that gives people that don't that watch the replay 
they don't get to share. But um, oh, I said the word. I wasn't supposed to say that. Sprinkle. <laughs> Shh, sprinkle. They're listening. Okay. So um, so we'll pick somebody and we'll come on. Who might come on? What time is it? I gotta read my watch. I got, a, I got a new watch and I can't read it yet. He's a college graduate. 30 till he does nine. not know what time it is. It, we're, we're, it's 8.30. It's 8.30. How should we be on her hour making a pineapple? So, um, that was supposed to be a quick cry. I'll take the finished one, please. Okay, well, you have to sprinkle, Karen. And we'll go through all the sprinklers. <laughs> that sounds funny, doesn't it? All the sprinklers and we'll pick somebody. We'll write everybody's name down and put numbers by them. And then I'll do the random generator and it'll pick a number. Um, that's how I've been doing it. So, um, so if you sprinkle, sprinkled, if you're new, sprinkled means this. So that's what it means. I just can't say that word on, on Facebook. Sprinkled. So they don't let me say that. So oh, it's 930 there, Donna. You're what, an hour ahead of us. So anyhow, so we're going to hop off and we'll go and look at all the sprinklers <laughs> and then we'll come back on maybe in a little bit. Yeah. I don't know. I'm okay. game. And um, we'll give people time to sprinkle. Y'all don't want to see my bed hit in the morning, I promise. So we'll, let's just do it tonight. No, me either. <laughs> so anyway, so I appreciate y'all getting on here with us tonight, guys. We've had fun. Um, I love coming on and visiting with all of you and finding out all about you and um, sharing part of my life here with y'all and in my happy room and my son. And we just love it. So um, just keep watching. And usually I go on live on Mondays and Fridays. So you can catch me then tonight was just a little extra because uh, he's here. So I'll next time I'll, well, we're going to get on live and do the thing. So, um, but anyway, but I appreciate all of y'all being here. I do. I love every one of you and I appreciate it. And thank y'all for watching. And we'll see you in a little bit when we come back to uh, give this away. So, okay. All right. I'll see y'all in a little bit. Thanks guys. I appreciate it. See y'all. All right. Bye-bye.